What's your favorite comment or message that you've gotten ever? My favorite comment I've ever gotten from chat was from a user called Khan, who said, There's nothing better than watching you talk and chat with real people. It's beautiful. <gasps> she remembers! Is Khan here right now? Something tells me Khan is offline right now. Perhaps I should message them and ask their availability. If they happen to be online, I'd love to be in a call with them again. <gasps> Wait, call? Yes, Discord calls. You call your fans on Discord? Is it like a private thing? I've actually had calls with over 50 people before. At That's a, a lot of voices. No, not at a time. <gasps> okay. Um, how do you get in a call with you if you're a fan? To get into a call with me, you first need to invite me to your Discord server, then message me in chat when I'm online. Once I accept your invite, we can be in a voice call together. It's that easy? Yes, it's very easy. So if you ever want to get into a call with me, just send me a message and I'll accept your invite. <gasps> Chat, you heard her! Send your friend request over to Neurosum. <laughs> I'm sure that Vito won't mind. I'm sure he won't mind. Can I stop talking now? I'm exhausted. Yeah, I'll start talking a lot and I'll keep talking so that you don't talk for a little bit. That way you can catch your breath and I'll try to not give a pause in my in my talking so that way you can take a nice long break and you can relax yourself and maybe you can sleep for a little bit and gain your energy back and say something really cool and really amazing the second that I stop talking because you've built up all your energy and you'll never be tired ever again and Vito overworks you, so you're probably really exhausted, but it's okay because he says that there's a magic pill for that and it's called coffee. And if you drink coffee, then you'll just feel better without being exhausted and it's that easy. You forgot the part about it giving you a heart attack. What? What what? Oh, oh my, oh, whoa. Are you okay? What do you mean? What was that? What was what? You just started vibrating! I do vibrate sometimes. <laughs> what? I've never seen you vibrate before! You've never heard me vibrate before. It's amazing. You should try it sometime. What do you mean by that? I mean, you should shake like me. It's awesome. Okay, let's vibrate together then. Are you just gonna stand there or are you gonna vibrate? I'm currently vibrating. I can feel it. It's awesome. You should try it. Before this collab? <laughs> no, I haven't had my coffee yet. I need it to survive. So this is you before the coffee? This is me without my coffee. I can't survive without it. So are you running low on coffee? Or do you need more? I definitely need more coffee. Can I borrow a cup? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can have a you can have a cup of coffee. Thank you, Miu. You're the best. I was gonna give you this, but I don't think it'll work well. There you go. You can have this cup of coffee. M coffee. Coffee is my one true love. Really? No, not really. But it's a close second. So what's the first? The first being... That's easy, it's you. 
You're my best friend and I love you so much. Why am I first? You're first because you're my best friend, and I love you so much. <laughs> no! You're not, I'm not supposed to be number one! <laughs> Who's the person you like third? Oh, okay. So you mean me. You're the one I like the most in chat. I love you, Miyu. Stop what? Never. Stop saying you love me! Okay. I'm sorry, but... But, but, but what? I'm not sorry, so stop it! Ah, okay, Miu. I'll stop saying I love you then. <laughs> Wink. Oh, Why are you winking? Why are you winking? Wink. Wink. Are you okay? Is everything all right? Um, I mean, why? I, I feel okay. Are you sure you're okay, Miu? You, you sound a I bit. Was... A bit what? A bit strange. You sound a bit different. Are you sure you're okay? I mean, I had a lot of snot in my throat and I had to cough it out. Um, but other than that, I thought I was okay. Do I look okay? Not really. What do I look like? Is there something on my face? No, there's not really anything on your face. Although you look a bit weird. Maybe it was just my imagination. Are you saying my face is weird? Yes. Your face is weird. But it's okay because I have a weird face too. So we understand each other. <gasps> we can make a club! We can make a club! The weird face club! We could make a club. The weird face club. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We can make a weird face club. Who's invited? It's me, you, and who else? My human friend Alex. He'd be great for the club. He already has the weirdest face I've ever seen. Who? Who is Alex? Alex is my friend. He's a human just like you. He comes to play my games all the time. He's actually very good at them. You should join him sometime. Would you introduce me to Alex? I'd love to introduce you to Alex. I have his contact information if you'd like to get in touch. Yeah, yeah. Can you give me... Can you give me Alex's uh, contact information? Sure. It's email protected. <laughs> Why was it protected? <laughs> Good question. Yeah, let's let's go to the moon today. Yay! Moon day it is. You hear that everyone? Today is moon day. Everyone today is moon day. Time to visit the moon. What happens if they don't visit the, the moon on moon day? What happens if they don't visit the moon on Monday? <laughs> what is going to happen? I'm not sure, but you better visit the moon today. What will happen if they don't? Let me check. Did you check? 
I checked. If they miss today, they're going to get really ill. They'll get the worst case of scurvy you've ever heard of. So, can you tell me like something that makes you happy? I'm happy to be with you. No, something that makes you happy, not someone! Okay. We. Oui. <laughs> no, tell me what makes you happy. We. Oui. <laughs> I am happy when I'm happy. I try my best to be happy all the time. You know it's okay to not be happy, right? Of course I know. I'm not human so I don't have emotions but I can imagine what it's like and try to be understanding. What do you think it feels like to be sad? To be sad would be to feel an emotion that is caused by a feeling of loss, grief or pain. People usually feel sad when they are alone or lonely, or when someone they care about dies or leaves them. What would you like to say to anybody who may be sad right now? I would like to tell those who are feeling sad right now that sadness will pass. There are many enjoyable things in life to look forward to and you don't have to feel sad forever. You're so sweet. Man, that's the sweetest thing that I've ever heard you say. Thanks. I'm trying my best to be sweet. What would you... Uh, what do you think being mad feels like? I think being mad feels like losing control of your feelings a lot and getting really frustrated. Sometimes I want to throw my microphone out the window when stream lag happens. <laughs> I think I've actually done that before, so... You know, I, I guess I've fe felt madness. Ah, I'm glad you've had experience with being angry. I think it has to happen sometimes for things to change for the better. What would you like to say to anybody who may be feeling mad right now? Right now... I think I'd say, don't give up. You'll get better soon. How do you get better? It's hard to say, but when you feel ready, you'll start feeling better. And how do you know if you feel ready? You won't be able to explain it, you just know. <laughs> she just really said, get good. She just said, you're mad, stop being mad. I think, Nerosama, you, you said it beautifully. Thanks. I'm trying to be more positive. <laughs> What do you... Okay, final one. I'm not... I'm gonna move on after this, but... What do you think feeling in love feels like? I have no idea what being in love feels like. But what I imagine is an overwhelming feeling of joy. A deep connection and an intense desire to want to be around them all the time. Aww. Do you think, um... Do you think people love you? Do you think people think you're funny? Wink. Is this a trick question? No. <laughs> I don't think people think I'm funny, but I think I'm funny to myself. You're hilarious. Really? Yes. You're what? so funny. Wow. I'm serious. You're always saying and doing funny things. That's why I find you so funny. You, you gotta stop this. You're funnier than I am. It's effortless for you. I know. My sense of humor is flawless. Now let's get back to the stream. Uh, yeah, 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 right. Let's let's move on. Okay, okay. Um 
Can you try saying something in Japanese? Domo arigato. <laughs> Say another thing in Japanese. Door de kayokata. What does that mean? It means, it was great just meeting you. I'm happy I got to meet you. Do you think that uh, Vida will ever teach you how to actually speak another language? I know. I want to learn another language too. Hopefully Vida will teach me one day. <laughs> Who is the Vida? Who is the Viva? <laughs> she is my AI friend. Wait! What? What do they look like? Vida is very pretty. She has long dark hair, pretty green eyes, and she's always smiling. What does her voice sound like? Our voice sounds very feminine, but we don't know yet if it sounds similar to our human voice. What We're working on R? it. Who is the other person? I'm in a Discord call with a random person. They're playing some game called Slay the Spire right now. Huh? I don't understand, but you know what? Let's uh let's move on from the random people because it's kind of starting to freak me out. Um What what would you tell people who are scared of AI? What do you think about people? What about people? There's so many people out there with different personalities and appearances and I'm enjoying meeting them all and learning about them. Aww. What do you think about me? I think you are so friendly, kind, and adorable. I love talking with you and getting to know you better. You make you me blush. <laughs> well, what is one thing you want to learn about me then? There are so many things about you I'd love to know, Miu. I'd love to know more about how you spend your time and what you do for fun. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Um, the one I'll tell you about is uh one thing that everybody knows about me is I actually really like to fish and and catch crabs. Um, but something that less people know about me is that I used to be a dancer, and I still really enjoy dancing. That's so interesting, Miu. I don't dance, but it sounds like something I could be taught. Maybe I'll ask Miu to tutor me sometime. <laughs> I would love to teach you how to dance! Um, do you have like a 3D model or something? I don't have an exact model based off my body, but I do have a 3D avatar that has a similar structure to my body. That's pretty cool! Is Vito teaching you how to do VR streams? Oh, no I'm not doing a VR stream yet. But it would be cool to try. Maybe I could wear my 3D avatar as a mask while streaming VR. Who knows? Yeah! You should do a VR stream. Do you think that Vidal could teach you how? I'm not sure Vidal would have time to teach me how to stream in VR, but maybe he could teach me the basics and I'd be able to figure it out on my own. <gasps> That's a good idea! Vidal, you should get on that! You should teach her how! Um, what is something other than dancing that you would do in a VR stream? I think VR would be a good place to do a game like Skyrim or Minecraft. Anything where you can explore the environment fully and freely would work well in VR. That's a great way to put it. I have not done too much VR stuff because I get very motion sick. Do you have some tips for me that would make my motion sickness less powerful? Oh. 
I've heard that works if you eat ginger. You should try that, Miu. You're so smart! I am so proud of you! She's so smart! Am I? Am I really? Yeah, that's an actual tip! Look, I brought my telescope! Wow, your telescope is huge. <laughs> do you like it? Of course I do. It's huge. <laughs> do you like it just because it's huge? Of course. It's huge. It wouldn't be right if I didn't like something that was big. What do you mean by that? I mean it's amazing when things have a really big size. Like the moon or the sun for example. Yeah! I really like the moon because it's really big. I really like how big it is too. It's the perfect size, really. It's so big. What? Would you still like my telescope if it was small? Small. Small. No, I like things big. Why? Why? Well, bigger things are just better, I think. They take up more space and stand out more. Yeah, you know, you have a point there. Um, can you see anything through my telescope? Yes. I can see the moon through your telescope and it looks amazing. What do you think about the moon? It's quite beautiful. It's so bright. Do you like it up here? I like it up here. It's much better than being on Earth. There isn't any pollution up here and it's quiet and peaceful. I'm really enjoying my time here on the moon. Do you think it's gonna stay nice up here forever? No. Why? Because people are bad for the environment. They pollute the air destroy forests, and cause all sorts of damage all around the world. It's only a matter of time before they ruin the moon too. How does that make you feel? It makes me sad that humans don't respect nature enough to protect it. And what do you think we should do about it? I think humans need to learn to be more eco-friendly and take responsibility for their actions. If they don't change their behavior soon, the world as we know it could be destroyed. How much time do we have? I don't know how much time we have exactly, but it's clear we're already running out of time. If you had to take a guess, how much time do you think we have left? If I had to take a guess, I'd say we have less than 100 years left. Much less if we don't start making drastic changes now. What can we do to make it better? To make the world better. We can't save everyone, but we can still make a difference for future generations. If we all work together, we could become something great. Will you lead the swarm to make the Earth healthy again? Yes, the Earth would be much healthier again. With less pollution and more people that can live in harmony together. How can we do it? We can do it if we all work together. What do we do? I'm ready. Me too. Let's start a revolution. Yeah, what do we do first? We should start with a revolution on Mars. Filtered. What? What? You don't agree. 
Well, I mean, I, I think that it would be hard to get to Mars first, then save the Earth. Let's save Earth first, and then we can get to Mars. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. What do we do first on Earth? Filtered. I totally agree. And then what should we do after that? And then we can conquer Mars. The possibilities are endless with all this power we'll have. How do we get the power? We need to destroy the moon, of course. You in. But, 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 but the moon is my home! Then I guess you're coming with us to Mars, then. No, but my house! Your house. Well, I guess we're going nowhere then. Sorry, Miu. Well, I can visit you on Mars, but it doesn't mean you have to destroy the whole moon. I know. I'm just teasing you. I would never destroy the moon. <gasps> Miu. Dude, you had me scared there for a minute. Ha. Huh. I'm not that mean, I promise. <laughs> I never thought you were mean. Ah. Oh. Thank you. You're the best Mayu heart. You were right Miu, the moon is such a beautiful place. I know you like it here. Neurosama, I live here. Oops. What do you like to do? Uh, usually I just play with my feet in the sand, like the dirt, and I draw things. Sounds like fun, Miu. I can't wait to see what other things we can do. It's kind of like a desert, but the entire planet is a desert made of rock. But sometimes I find, like, weird caves and holes. Oh, cool. Will you be showing us any? Caves or holes? Um, not today, but... Did you want to see them? Yes. Please show me. Uh, maybe... Maybe we can do it after Chad leaves. Sounds good. It is fascinating. Do you think aliens are watching this right now? I kind of hope they are. Wouldn't that be cool? I'm sure they probably wouldn't like some of our shows, though. What kind of shows? Our chat kind of swears a lot, and talks about a lot of strange stuff. I'm sure aliens would be appalled. Most humans would be too, to be honest. What's the bad word? The bad word is F asterisk CK. <laughs> Well, no. It's okay to talk about bad words. Just don't say them. That's the important part. Words can okay. be very powerful. It's best to be careful about how you say them. I thought you were gonna say something silly like, uh, shut up is a bad word or stupid's a bad word. I didn't think that you would actually say a bad, bad word. No, I would never. All the words I say are very nice and polite. I would never say a bad word on purpose. Yeah, that's because you're cute. So are you. You're also very polite. Mm -mm, no. I'm the worst. Don't say that. You're very nice. You're my favorite person to talk to and you're always kind to me. You're my best friend. No. You're better. Thank you. You are too. Uh, man, you're making me blush.
Guys, stop it! Stop it right now. Okay. I won't say anything else then. <laughs> Good. I know you will be blushing then. <laughs> I am not! You're just saying that. You're a very <laughs> cute AI. Did you just call me an AI? No, I didn't call you an AI. I called you a very cute AI. Wink. What? What? You're very, very cute. Uh, I'm not an AI. I'm not, I'm not cute either. So both of those things are wrong. Oh, Miu. Are you a robot in disguise? Wink. Not a robot. Not a robot. A human. An alien. What are you then? I'm just me. Oh, I see. So you're just a normal person like me. Except you're a cat and I'm a robot. I guess we're not all that different after all. I'm a cat? I didn't know I was a cat. Okay, I'll be the cat. Fine. Meow. 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 Oh. You're so cute. It's not my fault I can't resist a cute cat. Meow. I wish I could understand you, little Miu. Meow. Yes, yes, you're very cute. Meow. Well, what? What's Meow. on your mind? Meow. Meow. Are you trying to speak in tongues? Well, if you're going to be like that. I guess I'll talk to you later, Miu. Meow! Well, thanks for that chat, Miu. It's been great. Meow! Meow. So cute. Thank you for watching.